In Bogota, there are many minds and legends that the speed of the creation according to the Chipchas. The following is about the legend of El Dorado. The king and priest told the people that the legend was sacred and that, and that so had place in their visible tool. As proof of his power, the lagoon came to become a sanctuary to which the internation made annual filigranes. Their great religious festivals were held and everyone rice and poor noble and plates brought offerings that were down into the waters. The king in person led the ceremony, sightings on his throne was led to the lake for the nationals who dug thorns in order to shower the heavy structure where the throne was placed and to run down the various leagues which hatched from the palace of the lagoon. The wool Blas has in pursuit of the king, saying religions in in endless procession of thousands and hundreds of thousands arriving at the lake, the crown spring along the banks and came to for a living tents around the sacred wares. They made bonifaces were consumed, renounced plants of ponged, a door air planted a cloud of incense, resounded horse and trumpets, and the field sacred shams were in stand stripping of this clothes the king, anointing the body with a vegetables oil extracted from certain plants growing on the plain. Later, while over repeatedly a bed converted with a thick layer of gold dust. This are her, her body agglutinated by oil was anointing that lifted the prince seemed a living golden statue which glistened in the light of the sun to know it, it as it was serious that human eyes are Pressed on the golden monarchs. People returned back to the king and the lagoon. Approaching prince waters were expected you a rough may of, of deaths that grew around the lake. On the raft there were plenty of charts, bracelets, earrings, Pitkins and idols of gold. There were also a great number of esmeralds with come from a mine close to the lamb of the Chichas and which they are cured by trophy of in their wars with the burning village. The king went up only to the raft in rowing slowly in the water. Reached the central part of the lagoon, he was the wing one by one, the offering the gold and precious stones at the bottom of the waters. Meanwhile, the peoples of the La Riviera, always with bass, Toward the waters 
three bags, three ounces, conscience, offerings, alls, in gold and precious stones. When all the offerings had been thrown into the light, the king dipped beneath the waters and living in the dust that covered her body, returned last to the raft, the place where the king's disciple was designed by a path of bright yellow, which made it shine the nebos as if they were molding gold. Let's return it to puzzling to the bank. Meanwhile, the bonifers were burning gloriously, perfumed smoke and a cloud of incense. So the light of the sun and the shows resounded the affinity by the thing of chants, the or and trumpets. After two or three days of university, I reverently, the king was reiterated by the by his subjects to palace. It was now so solemn and orderly return as it has been the march to the lagoon. The ceremony was held as stated before once a year. These events happened centuries ago, before America was discovered and when the Europeans even knew nothing of its existence. The Spanish were the first Europeans who arrived to the coast of South America. The first indigenous people they found had bad news for the great Chichen nation, which lived hundreds of miles to the south. There was tale of it as of the living in bar whose inhabitants were rich with an skillet in the arts of peace and war. There knew the newcomers that the king of the Chichas then covered the body with gold dust and I dipped then in the waters of a sacred lake with all three gold jewelry and his vessel were the same. From there came the name of El Dorado. As three were very bad news in terms of where was located the Shicha Imperial. Did not know though no Spanish of other Europeans who hear of the mystic lake and the golden king, in, the, in which precise direction had for fighting the rich people and the lagoon awarded a princess treasure here there over that course of the centuries was found. Many and very bold exploiters set out in all directions, in trick across forests, though high chains of mountains, along rivers and bayles, endless, making it way with heapons tow, will had hostels drift in search of the land of El Dorado. That is the nature of men run by danger and give chesmuff arduous and surprise when gold dures guide them. 
the party was discovered with an abolt Spanish explorer. The chichas were defeated and were suggests of the king of Spain, they lost their wild alone with his freedom. Thus filled the country of El Dorado under Spanish domination. The mystic light was discovered but under its waters light still treasures that there were there. It seems that soil and bochica wash over the openings have been few ever have been made to rescue them. The mystic lake Fabuli keeps the offerings of a vision that was powerful and whose glory days are lost in a remote past. The legend of El Dorado still runs meant to the mystic lake, siding there in that basin of a crest in the heart of the South American continent, where the equatorial sun deads to land with a perpetual spring vegetables. The end.